Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. I get so many questions on what thread I use, like the brand, the type of thread, also the colors. People want to know exactly which colors I use um, because obviously it's hard to order thread when you do not know what color is what because you get a, a number. So I'm going to go ahead and go through all that with you guys, all the brands, the different types of thread I use, and the color numbers so that you guys can go ahead and order your colors. So yes, I have a lot of thread. I don't even know how many. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. So 24. There's 24 more. And these are different brand threads. There's some more here, some more here. And we got a bunch over here. And there's some on all the machines. Ooh. So yes, I have a lot of thread. I love thread. It's okay. I have a uh, hoarding problems, but that's cool. Almost every embroiderer does. Getting new thread makes me happy. So, I'm going to make you guys happy too. So, let's go ahead and get into all the threads so that you guys can figure out which thread is best for you and what colors you like so that you can go ahead and place that order. So, first things first. So, depends on what machine you have. So, these big cones are for multi-needle machines. And these smaller cones can work for both multi-needle and like the 4x4, 5x7, uh, Brother machines, Viking machines, all the flatbed machines these can work for. So, uh, let's get into it. So let's start with the uh, little threads. So here is the little Coates and Clark thread. I got these from Joann's. You can get them from Joann's as well. Always buy them when they're on sale. Never pay full price for these because they are $7.50, $7.49, something like that at Joann's. Um, this is the ones I, I, uh, I didn't start with these. There was actually another brand that I started with, which is the Brother thread that you can get on... Um, on Amazon. I'll put that link in the description. It's about, I think, 120 pack. I believe I'm not 100% sure, but it's a big pack of a bunch of different colors, and I believe it's about 60 bucks. So I will have that in the description below. So I use these little cones on my, all the way down here. I have a Brother PE 770. Now they don't make the 770 anymore. It is now the blurry. It is now the Brother PE 800, and I also have the link to that below in the description. <coughs> <coughs> these threads work well for it, the Coates and Clarks threads. And I also used the Isocord thread. So these are these smaller spools by Madeira. I use big and small. Um, these are 1,100 uh, yards, whereas the big ones are 5,500 yards. Um, these are 2.99. So keep in mind that this one is one from Joann's, the Coast and Clark's. They're both 1,100 yards. Joann's charges 7.49, and Madeira 2.99. So. Madeira is much better quality anyways, and it is shinier, it just stitches better than the Coats and Clarks. But, if you don't want to order online, you can always pick these up at Joann's for a last minute thing, if you just need a color really quick. I've used these, I used these for probably a year before I started using Madeira, and once I used Madeira, I never went back. Unless, for instance, the hot pink, I use this hot pink, this is the Coats and Clarks hot pink from Joann's. I haven't been able to find a hot pink that matches the exact color, um, because Madeira has hundreds of colors. Let me show you. So here is their color chart and no, I am not sponsored. There's so many colors on here. Like, come on. Come on. So I, I keep buying different ones but I never the right ones. So uh, I just still use the Coastal Clarks. I still have it. Like I said, if you have the brother, if you have like a five by seven machine, flatbed machine then you can get the ones from Madeira the 1100 yard snap cones now the Madeiras that I like are the poly neon cones um it doesn't matter which side but they're the poly neon they're not rayon they're poly neon so that means they're 100% polyester like I said they are they are shiny as you can probably see they have some shine to them so like I said they stitch out so much better than the Coats and Clark um Coats and Clark to me is a little on the duller side but hey so you can get the Madeira thread at a lot of different places. I'll put some links to Amazon down below because Amazon does sell some. Um, and so does uh, allstitch.net, there's United Thread. There's so many websites you can buy them from, but I'll link the Amazons below. So what a lot of you, a lot of you, a lot of you, a lot of you, a lot of you want to know is what colors, what, what are my go-to colors? So if you guys could not tell, if you guys could not tell by looking at my machines, what my favorite colors are. Pew. I have my go-to colors. So, I have a lot of different colors, but my go-to's. I like this for lavender. Now, it took forever for me to get the orange right. So, the first time I ordered orange, I thought this was perfect. 
But as you can see, this is like a neon orange. So the orange is $17.65. I also want to give you guys a good idea of what they look like. So this is, if it'll focus, this is my turquoise. This is what I use for turquoise. Um, it is 1977. Pinks. Pinks are like the most popular questions. What pink, what pink, what pink. So this is a light pink. A lot of people like light pink. This is number 400. No, I'm a lie. It's not. Where is it? You. Where is the number? Oh, wow. I've never had a number. Actually, it's under here. That's odd. Let's try this again because I have two. Okay, this one is 1816. Same as that. The other thread which is the thread I started with when I got into the bulk threads, is the Robinson Anton thread. I don't know if I'm saying that right. So here are a few colors. I haven't been able to find the same colors to go over as, as in with Madeira. So I still have this. I love this color. It is like a yellow gold. Um, it's called Merit Gold <coughs> by, by Robinson Anton. So I like these as well. Um, let's see. This, I still haven't been able to find either. I found close, but they're never the same. Um, and this one either. This is called OC Anic Green, but they're not exact. Like I said, they still stitch out different. They look so close on camera, even though it won't focus. But in person, they're really not that close. So my suggestion is to get the Madeira brand thread. No, I'm not sponsored again. Before we go any further, if you guys could please like this video, Please, it helps me. I don't get paid for that, but it helps. It helps. It just it just helps. So if you guys want to help me out, please just give this video a thumbs up. Like it. Share it. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And just leave a comment down below. What is your favorite color from what you've seen here? Or if you have Madeira thread and it's a color I don't have, what is a thread that you think I should have, should get? I think it'll be easy for me to go ahead and pull my favorite colors and then show you guys them up close. So to start, my first go-to thread is white. White, white, white. And the number is 1801. So I always use this. These are gonna be my top 10 go-to threads. My next go-to thread is going to be black, 1800. I use this again. These are all the top 10 I reach for. So here is the black, 1800. My next go-to color is gold, although it doesn't look gold right here, but it is gold. I use this for unicorns, Minnie Mouse, everything. Number 1791, gold. 1834 is my next go-to color. This is a royal blue for me. I use this a lot for my boy shirts. My next go-to color is this pink. I consider this a bubblegum pink. I use this on almost every single shirt, so this is probably one of the most important threads I do have. Next we have red. This one is number 1838. Now I love this red because it is not too deep of a red and it is also a brighter red. The next color is mint green. It is 1845. I use this a lot on my unicorns. This is totally not picking up the right color. <coughs> so this is looks like a blue in the in the video, but this is a purple. This is my go-to royal purple. And it is number 1832. Again, this is not even close to what it really looks like. Nope, it's still showing the wrong. It's this is literally like a normal purple. Normal purple, 1832. My next go-to color is this lavender. It is a little bit lighter than you could, than it appears in this picture. I use this a lot. It is 17E11. Last but not least, my MVP, my fuchsia. This is my number one color. I use this the most out of everything I use. And it is number 1990. Okay guys, those are my top 10 go-to colors. Um, please comment down below your favorite colors. What is your favorite brand of thread that you use? Leave that down below as well. And you can also uh, leave down any questions, comments, any other videos you would like me to make for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Guys, I did want to mention that the ribbon. I know a lot of you guys ordered ribbon for me. I am out of stock of a lot. So to be completely honest and completely transparent with you guys, I order a lot of ribbon and you guys never cease to amaze me. You guys 
make I sell out within a week every time. Now, every time I'm ordering more and more, and I because I can't anticipate how many of you guys buy things. Obviously, my YouTube has grown so much because only about a month and a half ago I was only at what 3,000 subscribers. Now I'm at 15,000. So thank you guys so much. Now, also. I did already have an order coming, it'll be here on Monday the 18th, so some will be going back up on the website, but again guys, you know, if you, a lot of you guys order ribbon for me, it sells out so fast. So I did place another order, so I have a huge order coming, I ordered three times the size guys because so many of you guys are just being so supportive and buying, some, uh, buying the ribbon, so place the big order. And now I'm telling you guys, I hate when companies I order from run out, sell out of items. So, I don't wanna be like that. <laughs> so what I'm doing is I am going to be placing huge orders, trying to keep everything in stock at all times. So again, I'm sorry that everything keeps selling out so fast, but I myself did not anticipate it to be doing so well. So thank you guys again so much for all your support. I really just spent on myself. <laughs> I really appreciate it. And I will, you know, try and try to make sure everything stays in stock for you guys. So thank you guys again. Also, I know you guys want to this embroidery machine video. I know you want it. So make sure you like in all my videos, comment on all my videos, and that video will be coming soon, very soon, because I did say after baby boy was here. Now I gotta find the time because you know. But you guys, I'm at 15,000 now, so let's keep it going, and that video will be coming soon. Just make sure you go ahead and like all my videos, comment on all my videos, and I'll be making that video for you guys. Alright guys, bye! So you guys can buy that off of Amazon, and that's what I use for my brothers. You can see... So these are the Madeira, so these are the Madeira uh, smaller spools. These are 1100 yards, I believe. Let me check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. Here's their color check, guys. Mm -hmm. There's so many colors. That's not it. Ooh. Fail. Keep in mind that 